2021 and I'm gonna ask you one question. Are you bad at Blender? If so, I'm here to encourage you and let you know that just three years ago, I was working at a pet company and decided I wanted to learn Blender after hours. And here I am now working in Silicon Valley with major tech brands using Blender as part of my daily workflow. In this video, we're gonna go through a lot of the resources I used to learn and then some new ones that have come out since then. If you're impatient like me and you've already seen some of these things, I've put time codes in the description so that you can skip ahead into the video to the part that's most interesting to you. We'll start with some free resources and move on to paid resources later. Also stay tuned to the end of the video if you'd like to learn more about my new animation course and the beginners that just came out today. Let's get started. First, we'll go through some of the YouTube channels that I think are best for learning Blender. Blender Guru, and I apologize because most people already know this tutorial, but if you're just starting out in Blender, then I highly recommend Blender Guru's donut tutorial as a starting point. It'll walk you through the basics of creating a scene in Blender for the first time. His channel also has plenty of other great content for more advanced users. CG Boost is another great YouTube channel for learning Blender, but specifically, he has an entire free course on learning Blender, and it says 2.8, but it's still very relevant for the 2.9 series. Pierrick Picot has some astoundingly deep and clever videos on rigging. He also has a great course, which I will share later in this video. Blender's channel itself, I feel like not many users know this, but it has an amazing interface overview series on their channel by Dylan Gu, a successful animation channel creator who uses Blender. Lightning Boy Studio is your go-to source for anything tune related. They have an amazing Ghibli tree tutorial and some great tune shaders. Mostly working in Eevee, these are great for slower computers. Peter Francis channel has some really cool deep dives into how he creates these Hollywood level 3D scenes in Blender. Blender Secrets posts daily minute long tips. Check these out every morning to keep Blender on your mind and to learn little hidden tips. Ducky 3D is your go-to guy for anything abstract. He has a strong design sense and explains everything in simple terms. Great starting place for any Blender user. Grant Abbott does a lot of video game models and he's great at explaining his efficient modeling techniques and texturing pipeline. Jan Sculpt is an incredible sculptor and a great resource for anyone who would like to dive deeper into the amazing sculpting tools in Blender. Gleb Alexandrov has plenty of great lighting and hard surface modeling tutorials. He's also got some great courses, which I'll share later in this video. Josh Gamble is another amazing hard surface modeler. His videos are more technical, but you're great for mastering the basics of Blender modeling. One of the most entertaining channels is Ian Hubert's and his famous lazy tutorials where he creates complex tutorials and short format funny videos. These aren't necessarily great for beginners, but if you're already familiar with Blender, these are a great way to learn things quickly. CG Matter and his second channel, Default Cube, are a great resource for visual effects training, procedural nose, and all crazy math potential of Blender. Curtis Holt is a great resource if you're interested in learning the more technical sides of Blender, including development and add-ons. Blender Binge does a variety of Blender tutorials, usually around more practical and client examples that you might get during freelance contracts. In addition to YouTube, I also constantly searched and posted on websites such as Blender Stack Exchange, Blender Artist, Blender Nation, and Blender Subreddit for feedback, inspiration, and help. This is where I got a lot of help with the little questions that I couldn't figure out on myself from watching videos. I can't possibly cover every great YouTube Blender channel out there, so I highly recommend that you tag your favorites in the comments below so that other people can learn from them as well and they can get more subscribers. Next up, let's look at some intermediate and some advanced resources, specifically in the form of paid courses. Now, if you can't afford courses right now, I'll make sure to mention whichever ones have free trials so that you can try them out for free or even carry them in a few courses during that trial period. Now, you can learn a lot from free resources. However, I found that when I paid for a course, it was short and concise and I was able to learn what I wanted to a lot more quickly and I felt like I got my money's worth out of them. Let's take a look at some of the courses out there that I recommend. CG Cookie is probably where I had the most success getting over that beginner's hump. They have an excellent selection of beginner and advanced tutorials, and they also have a free trial. It's a subscription base, so when you sign up, you get access to everything at once, which is great. CG Boost, who I mentioned before, has both free and paid resources, and I highly recommend checking out his paid courses for advanced deep dives. On the Blender market, there are a couple courses, but specifically I wanna call out Hard Surface Modeling. This course by Gleb Alexandrov and Eddie Burroughs is astounding, and for the amount of content you get, it's an amazing price. This is the go-to course for hard surface modeling if that's what you're interested in. Gleb has also been teasing a new course on lighting, which if you've ever seen his work, he is very good at. So I'm sure that's going to be amazing soon in the future as well. Skillshare is another website with a subscription service where you get access to everything at once and a self plug. I host my courses here and I just released a new one today, your first animation in Blender 3D. Link in the description below if you'd like to see that course and sign up for a free trial through my link. Udemy or Udemy is another Skillshare-like resource that has an extremely long 
long and deep courses. These courses are not great if you're impatient, but they do go very in-depth and they are a great resource if you're looking to learn Blender. MoGraph Mentor, another self-plug here, but Ducky3D and I have some courses on here and they're aimed at intermediate users for rigging and abstract renders. A lot of these resources I'm mentioning are more for intermediates, and there are a few resources I'd like to call out specifically for advanced users. First up is the Blender Cloud. Who better to teach Blender than Blender themselves? Blender Cloud is another subscription resource, and it's great for intermediate users who are looking to become more advanced. They also have their project files on here available for you to study so that you can reverse engineer those and learn from them. Flipped Normals. I rarely see this site appear on Blender resource list because they don't only cover Blender. Flipped Normals have some affordable and advanced courses, and they have a great ultra advanced course on rigging. Next up, let's talk about resources that aren't specifically educational, but rather where you can get some models and textures and HDRIs for free that you can use while you're learning Blender. First up is CG Trader. It's a great resource for models, rigs, and more. They have a free filter and a blender filter, and if you don't wanna buy the models, just tap that little free button and it'll show you everything they have for free in your search. Mixamo lets you download pre-rigged models with motion capture animation, but it also lets you upload your own models to automatically rig them and apply motion capture data. I cover this in my hair video tutorial. HDR Haven is the go-to place for free HDRIs, which can help with lighting your scenes very quickly if that's something you struggle with. CC Zero Textures is a great place for free PBR materials and has a huge library with high quality materials. I also make textures on my Patreon and sometimes give them away for free, like this MoGraph pack seen here. I'm also working on something very big, so stay tuned. Lastly, I just want to say that a lot of the YouTubers that I mentioned at the beginning of this video have Patreon, so if you're interested in supporting them, check those out. But they also have a lot of exclusive resources. Some have extended tutorials, some have full recordings, some have project files. I personally post project files, recordings, and textures on my Patreon, so feel free to check those out and support your favorite channels. You never quit learning Blender, and I hope that in another three years, I'll be far better than I am today. Let me know your favorite resources in the comments below and tag me at Southern Shoddy on Instagram so I can share your artwork made from these resources. Make sure to call it in the description which one you used. Thanks for watching. Hi, I'm Remington from Southern Shoddy 3D, and today we're going to be learning how to animate your first character. If you're like me, you love creating characters and imagine them in your own little worlds. With animation, you can finally bring your characters to life. 3D is difficult, and aside from the fact that there is another entire dimension to worry about, we also have all these intimidating programs we have to learn, and in this course, we'll cover the basics of Blender's user interface and be moving at a pace that should be comfortable for beginners. This course will provide a character rig for you to use and animate. I will also walk you through places you can grab other character rigs if you want to follow along with a different character. We'll be creating this animation by the end of the course. 3D is a high demand right now, and since I've added it to my skill set, I found better, higher paying clients. I think this course is great for anybody who wants to explore 3D, 3D artists, game devs, or even animators looking to add 3D to their skill set. A little bit about me. I started as a motion graphics artist working at small studios and agencies and eventually worked my way up to larger brands and tech companies. Now I work at a social media giant out here in Silicon Valley and I get to do character animation every day. I really love my job and I believe that the skills in this course could help you find your dream creative job as well. We'll not be covering rigging in this course because rigging is the process of adding animation controls to your 3D modeled characters. It's a highly technical process that would demand an entire course on its own. If this is something that interests you, I'll link to some free and paid resources in the resources section. I've also included a full recording of my modeling and rigging process if you're interested in watching that as well. I'm really excited to share this project with you and I'm looking forward to see what animations you create from this course. So let's get started together.